Think about what you want to say. Whenever I found myself needing help, in trouble, or confused, my dad was always there for me, but not in the traditional sense. He always felt there was a lesson to be learned, and every time a predicament arose, I would hear him say the same thing to me each time. So, what are you going to do? It wasn't a question he would say, but a statement, a uh, rhetorical statement. It was a question I should ask myself. What should I do? I use this to feel in control. So I knew growing up that I was in control of my own problems, and I have the ability to fix aspects of my life without help. I'm telling you this because this is what built my character, and this is how I grew up to who I am today. My name is Skylar Ellis. I'm 20 years old, and for most of those 20 years, I am at being in control of my life and always aspired to better myself. In order for you to get to know me better, I'll discuss where I lived, my academic interests, and a hobby of mine. First of all, let me tell you about where I live so you can get to know me better. I was born in Santa Monica, but moved all around Southern Cal and even up to Sacramento for a while. I found myself coming back to LA because of school. I'm familiar with the area and it's comforting being where it feels like home. Sacramento is where some of my family moved up to, and since then has turned into a summer getaway. Um, while in LA, I'm a student majoring in business. Next, let me tell you about my interest in business. Okay, now I'm going to have you turn that paper over. You know it. Now I'm going to have you step over here. I don't and think it, you know it. It, yeah, Well, you don't know why you're interested in business? Oh, okay. Yeah, I think you do. I don't care how many times you say um or uh or like. And really, I don't want you to say it exactly how you wrote it on the paper. But I want you to talk to us about business. So I'm like, listen, I'm majoring in communication. What are you majoring in? Yeah. And why? Okay. Majoring in business, uh, my dad was always in business, so a lot of that brushed off onto me. Mm -hmm. um, I see that I need to sort of prove myself, and I think that uh, sort of following in his footsteps and what I grew up knowing is a good goal um, would be a good way to prove myself, but especially to my dad, that I'm able to work hard and achieve uh, good things in the way. Are you going to go into what you want to do with that business in um, the next point, or no? No. Okay. What do you want to do with that business? What do you think? I don't know. Isn't that fun? Yeah. yeah, who knows? You know, you want to do business. Yeah. Just where? The sky's the limit. Yeah, I was actually thinking, um, that, well, I was looking at financing. Oh. Something that's a one on one. Uh, people pay you for your services rather than just working and risking your own money, things like that. Mm, finance. Can't encourage it enough. Yeah. Wish my parents were like, Amanda, oh, let's do finance. Yeah. Yeah. That's a whole a story for a different day. All right, kid. You ready? Yeah. Now I will let you turn it over and get a glance. But we know that he doesn't what? Need yeah. You don't. Do you want me to uh, can go to my next? Yeah. Okay. You're ready. Let's, let me see what it is. <laughs> yeah, sure. Take a look. Third, let me tell you about a hobby of mine. Mm -hmm. so you can get to know me better. I play music, I play guitar for most of my life, um, and I use it as a way to keep myself uh, kind of at peace. I use it when I'm stressed out, I use it if I uh, need to think. It's just a great hobby, and it's one of the things I enjoy most in the world. So it's too bad that there's not a uh, lot of money in the music uh, job market, I guess. Um, in closing, what I share about myself feels like what really describes me and what I associate with. Also, I'm only 20, so my life should continue to unfold and develop. And soon I'm sure I'll associate myself with new ideas and new interests. Yay!